You want to go on an adventure? Come on, come with me. It's going to be fun. <laughs> Let's hang out. Hey, I'm Dan Sage. For those who are new here, I am writing poems on demand in the streets for strangers. I'm going to miss the desert. I really will. I love cactus so much. I just love cactus so much. I, just, I want a cactus everywhere I go. Cactus, cactus. How am I going to bring some cactus to Bali? Oh, I need cactus. You think they'll let me bring that on the plane? What's the price? What's the edit? Cause I'm alive and I don't credit a source. I just drive and then the fog rolls in. Then the blind my enemies that just try. Trying to kill me Breaking the waves I can and I know I try Ocean that's strong I cannot stem the tide Breaking the waves I cannot know If I've tried Till I can't seem to stand <laughs> you made it. <laughs> now we got a problem. What is the problem? The problem is there's a lot of problems out there in the world. That's a problem. We got a lot of problems. No sparkling water. Ah, oh, true story. Uh, we got a problem. We ain't got any sparkling water. But the sparkling water? I asked her, I said, we have sparkling water. Aisle four. <laughs> Lower shelf to your left if you don't see it there we'll have it tuesday morning at 6 15 sir <laughs> give me san pellegrino tuesday morning at 6 15 sir thank you i'll get back to you three to five business days you know how there's, uh, there's hosp good hot springs over here the government's trying to warn you not that there's no hot springs over here <laughs> <laughs> they put up like 10 signs i swear no hot springs no hot springs oh here's another one no hot springs. Don't burn it down. Boys, we're stuck. <sighs> what are we gonna do? It's like we got a problem. An actual problem. We got an actual problem now. <laughs> we have to chain up, boys. Here we go. I'm gonna give you the good chain. One of the chains is bro is broken. I'm gonna put that one on. <clears throat> Whoever gets their chain on first, it gets a hundred dollars. No, yeah. <laughs> okay. No, no, no. That's gonna go around the back of it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'm getting frustrated. I have to be a male man. <laughs> All right. Now what? Read the instructions. <laughs> I can't read. <laughs> yeah, I, I need. I need to make mine better. This one's. See, this one's effed up right here. I can't get that chain undone. See, you guys got the solution to that. Leave me a comment below. If you see a no trespassing sign, look on the other side of it. Usually they don't say anything.
After exhilarating cold plunges in the mighty Rio Grande and hours of catching up in nature's womb, we hiked back up the gorge connected to the earth in a deeper way. My cousin Brandon and I were close like brothers growing up. We played video games long into the night, invented new catchphrases based on the wild world around us, and played until exhaustion. There is still magic there for me when I see him, an inner child and both of us still alive, open to the world of possibility. This one fell off. Shit, this one fell off too. What do you think about the snow now? Fuck that day, it's gonna bother. <laughs> Will I wanna experience that all over again? <laughs> no. I forgot, we're vloggers now, we have to show our food. And we're preparing it now. And um, got some gunk on the window, but um, Brandon has a trick. He's shaving the window, and somehow it's working. This can work on a, a thick, hairy ass. It can work on a window. <laughs> Everybody was so sweet. They all cheered me on and, and toasted me and said how much I meant to them. It really warmed my heart um, to be wanted in that way. It meant a lot. First of all, I'll just say how I met Dan because that seems to be part of the, the trend here. I met Dan at the gym <laughs> there in the locker room. And he's like, yeah, you know, I'm building my house out there on the Mesa, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, oh, really? No shit. I'm doing a YouTube channel and I'd love to come and interview you. It's, it becomes so much more than a house that way. It's a life. It's not just uh, a physical object. It's yeah. like, the, the, that's what is special about the adobe. You know, you work the earth with your hands and then your DNA and sweat goes into the earth and then it bonds and then it's there forever. So if you don't like the people that helped you, then that's really bad because, <laughs> you know, then that, they're there forever. Then their spirit is there, I think. Is what I think. We packed up everything. Packed up everything, ready to go. I am moving out. I rented out my house. Cool guys over here looking super cool. This other cool guy, look at that guy. Look at how cool he is. Yeah. <laughs> so, yep, I'm gonna pack, uh, pack some stuff up and head out. I'm gonna head out and uh, go. I'm about to go. Feels crazy. You know, I love this house, love this place, but sometimes in order to do, move on in your life, you gotta take a leap and start the next, next chapter. And uh, yeah, looking forward to that. Uh, crap. Um, what do I say? What do I want to say? You, yeah, what do you want to say? Welcome to my tour. <laughs> <laughs> Did you move somebody else from Texas into my neighborhood, Daniel? <laughs> It's gonna be nothing but Texans in here now. Sure, sure. You just let them know, man. If they don't act right, I'm popping their tires. All right. You get down on camera? Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, house. I love you. I love you so much. Oh, I'm gonna miss you. I really am. I, I really, really am. Not Wait, bad. Oh, I know. I can't put okay, my shoes okay. on. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> No anyway. fucking dog hair in it. Don't even feel like the Mesa, huh? It's pretty clean. I know why you made it all Airbnb cool. I love you all. See you Go soon. Go on an adventure. Don't even be sad about it. Dude. Get your ass in the car. <laughs>
<laughs> oh god. What am I gonna do? I hired this Mesa guy for a ride and I don't know what to do. Oh, buy a house. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Joshua Tree. <laughs> My money, bitch. Real sweet. <laughs> I got that early morning fog, you know, you wake up to catch your flight or whatever, uh, and you just can't think. All right, we're riding in the bins today. Yeah. Let's go. Unfortunately, we got some issues in the sky, but uh, you know, uh, if you know, you know. So uh, spread awareness where you can. Let's go. Climate engineering is an ongoing issue all over the world and it's affecting all of us. We need to rise up together to put an end to this practice that is poisoning the web of life with aluminum nanoparticles. Subscribe to Dane Wigington's YouTube channel uh, below in the description to learn more. Ah, suspicious poet, poet right there, reading a book of coffee. What's next? He's getting ideas about his next poem. Suspicion flows through his mind. Suspicion gaining momentum. Mental fuses overload. Nuclear catastrophe on the rise. But what's this? An idea has just erupted. And he gets pondered. And the pondering grows more and more intense. And he says, Oh shit, Henry Wadsworth Longfellow is about to go out of business thanks to me. Robert Frost, step aside. I'm coming after you. I shot an arrow into the air. It landed not, I knew not where. Rated info mature. Here's a tour of my home city. There's the penis building. That's what um, we all worshiped growing up. We all just went over down here and, and just went like, Happiness. See? I wasn't kidding. Downtown Winston-Salem, that's my hometown. Uh, RJ Reynolds headquarters are those smokestacks over there. We got donuts, Tabasco, and diabetes. Everything is kind of conservative and really religious. When you first meet some people, one of the first questions they're gonna ask you is what church do you go to? I just have more of a free spirit. I never really felt like I belonged. It feels good to be home, you know, but it also feels like I don't really belong here also. <laughs> it's kind of strange. I want the first to say I got you. Sure. What are the things that um, you're happiest about? Yeah, I somehow found myself on this island, on this, uh, this planet. And I'm being asked to find some solutions for a small planet. Yeah. Here I am. Okay, yeah. what am I gonna do with this? You know? Yeah. How am I gonna play with this? Yeah. It's a a duty I feel like to serve the planet, you know, or to help people. The human race. Oh, 
need to decompress from all that. Let's go to a bookstore. What do you say? I can say a lot of things, <laughs> but I'm going to say let's go to a bookstore. There is always something so comforting about words and books, other worlds that lie within these covers. They help soothe my soul, give me respite from just how difficult this physical life can be. This, this is what I would always go read, all the mags over at Barnes & Noble as a kid. Music, actually I, this really helped me get into music, coming over here just reading the magazines. Spending no money, buying nothing, because I was 13 years old. <laughs> Challenging sister, difficult bond to messenger, don't shoot. Here to inspect the relationship between two of kin. The sisterhood begins when you open to the darkness. Exclaim power to haunt amiss pines in the forest of relation. Demarcation of truth inspects you thoroughly then is stinging proof of parts of self yet to be healed still yet to blame no one open tongue connected to hearts made in the same womb wow there you go i, I want to hear another verse now <laughs> I have, this one's a bit longer Mother, I missed you, miss you memory. Thought how could even one smiling moment be all we got, but it was and will be. No matter how each of us go alone. Mother, I remember the telephone used to talk, but sometimes along, sometime along one of us forgot to maintain the connection. Looking back, I would hope for a resurrection after we have swum the streams begun in the spirit planes it teems with love somehow i owe you everything and nothing all the same my heart takes over whenever my brain wants to explain any of this miracle away Check out your shoes, you know, I got a new pair. Oh yeah? Check out my shoes? Yeah, you know, the Asian kids have the coolest shoes. And as Daniel decides to leave this country, and to visit another country and start a new life, we pray, we ask thee to bless the journey. Hey. Hello. 